Ash as well talking about, about uh, Premiership footballers not being able to celebrate and uh, find it difficult after they score goals. You scored plenty of tries last year. How did you find that transition? Yeah, it's hard. Obviously, you know, when you get over for a try and you're excited, especially if it's you know an important part of the game. You know, say the Challenge Cup and you get over for a couple of tries. You know, it's, it's going to be hard not to celebrate, but we're going to have to do these things. You know, it's, it's the safety of us, all us health, and um, you know, we've got to put that first at the minute. And if we have to all back from celebrating, then we're going to have to do all that. Thinking back to last year and, and when the rules came in about not celebrating after tries, was there anything you did differently, maybe in training, to get used to, to not doing it? Uh, we were all practicing air high fives, but that went out of window. Everyone ended up getting fined straight away. So, you know, you, can, you just don't think about it. You're just in the zone playing, and you know, if someone jumps on your back, gear, I jumped on my back a numerous amount of times and cost me a fiver or two. So, you know, it is hard, but you know, we've got to try. We've got to try and point it next year. By and large, though, after a couple of weeks, everyone seemed to to get up to up to speed with it. Super League players were able to adapt, and you saw all the time. Players are not celebrating anymore after trying to. Yeah, yeah, everyone sort of got used to it, obviously. Everyone probably got hit too many times with fans, so they couldn't afford to, to keep celebrating. Uh, so, uh, yeah, everyone sort of got the hang of it and you know, they, could, they could do it. And so, hopefully, the, you know, the Premier League players can jump on board as well. And even in the biggest of games, you, you've managed to adapt to it. I've watched back your two tries at, at Wembley in a Challenge Cup final, and, and you still have the presence of mind after you score each of them not to. Not to celebrate, just push fist pumps and that's it? Yeah, a couple of fist pumps on the first one. Um, you know, it was the first try of the game, I think, so. Um, you know, you're still a bit nervous and you don't want to be celebrating too much anyway, but then my the second try, we were sort of chasing the game and I were a bit knackered anyway, so I want another bullet to celebrate. I just wanted to get back in position and hopefully try to get the win. So, have you got, have you got a bit of sympathy for the, the Premiership footballers adapting to it and, and learning? You know, not not to, to let the emotions take over. Yeah, definitely. It's you know, everyone knows when you're in a game, you're not really thinking too much. You're just doing what you always do, and you know they'll be used to celebrating as much as they always have done. So uh, it will be hard for them to do, but you know, hopefully they can get used to it.